Welcome. Today we're going to take a look at Delmia Works ERP system, examine some of the uh, features and the functions that assist you in your manufacturing environment. And we have a block diagram we'll put up right now. You'll be able to see all the different features and functions. Those items with the dark blue backgrounds are part of the core. They come automatically when you purchase Delmia Works. The items with the white backgrounds are optional modules that you may or may not need all of them. You might need them at the very beginning of the implementation. Sometimes they're installed, um, you know, a year or two later, depending when your need arises to get to those particular areas. Because we have one code base and one single database, all the codes written by Delmia Works, uh, those modules can be added at any time. There's no need to worry about um, version mismatches and upgrades, things like that. So if you wish, pause the video, take a quick peek at some of the different modules, and right after that, we'll jump into taking a look at some of them. An ERP system is used by a company to manage the important parts of their business. It should integrate all departments into one single source of the business truth in operating. That means it should have live data for all these areas of estimating, manufacturing, machine monitoring in real time, sales and distribution, warehouse management and control, the typical GL, AR, AP, PO receiving and payroll functions for accounting, time and attendance, workforce, process costing, e-commerce, forecasting, quality, of course, CRM, asset management, and expense reports are all required as well. Just as a note, most of these users will not see all of these tabs and selections. They will, in most cases, only require a single tab or two for the completion of their regular job functions and duties. I have all these enabled at once for this high-level walkthrough. Estimating is a key component of any valid ERP system. When quoting a new project, quickly and accurately accounting for all the labor and material is key. Being able to generate these and have a quote log such that we can see which items are approaching their due dates, which items are being worked on and by whom, uh, are the revisions associated with that, and all the various tools and pieces that we need to go ahead and work on these quotations. Of course, getting these estimates set up is key in being able to go ahead and work with all the data that's going to be brought in. And that could be from just selecting whether we've got items in inventory or manufactured items that we include. But we have to also the ability to go ahead and add item details. We can work with calculations on how we go ahead and work all of these things up so that we have a complete history of where the estimating came from. Because in most cases, a lot of these estimates aren't looked at for days, weeks, months, possibly even years later from actually providing that estimate. We have the ability to also bring in the um, engineering side of things, and we can bring in the actual engineering quotes to the estimates and ensure that we have all the details and data to provide a very quick, clean, and thorough estimate to our customers. With Delmia Works, order entry is much more than just creating a document with the details of the purchaser, payment terms, and the items ordered. Is the customer on credit hold? What are the delivery requirements? Do we deliver to address A but invoice to address B? Are the inventory items available or do they need to be manufactured? We can quickly and easily see right here what's on backlog. If they need to be manufactured, when would they be ready? The date is the customer to promise date, which is readily available for the customer service agent to see at any particular time. Customer to promise is key to make sure that we have those particular items available to them and make sure that we can meet those dates. Here we can see we split the order and the first 100 in green have been shipped. The purple highlighted items are yet to be manufactured and we have a delivery date of when they will be available. These dates are calculated by not only the inventory items that we have in stock, the raw materials that are available, any items that might have to be procured and brought in with whatever lead times they have, as well as querying the manufacturing schedule to ensure those items can be put into that process and manufactured and yet still be available for that date that we promised the customer. As we can see, order entry is key in any manufacturing system to keep our customers content and ensure that they return for subsequent orders. How many companies today are still scheduling with whiteboards and Excel spreadsheets, not to mention post-it notes on the wall? Delmia Works offers tools beyond just scheduling. The manufacturing and scheduling 
and production planning software modules go way beyond just producing a good schedule. The powerful and flexible system is updated in real time for events occurring throughout the supply chain. Indications such as the red one we see here indicate right off the bat that we do not have the work order capable of being finished on time. Right away, we know that when there is a problem and what we need to do to take care of it. Of course, we can drag and drop these items anywhere we wish within the schedule. We can move them ahead. We can take them and put them in any order of operations to suit the schedule and make sure the machines run. Here we can see that the machine center that we're going to drag and drop that to is not one that through history has shown us that that particular product runs the best on that machine. There could be different machines that we have a much better run rate on. However, not available at this moment. So we say, okay, we go ahead and we go ahead and move that into where we wish it to be. And right away that schedule will update and we're going to have that pushed where we need it. The schedule itself will go ahead and adapt and move those files. As you can see, we've moved that to the top. But at any point, if we wish, we can go ahead and we can grab another work order and we can go ahead and push that up into the system. Very well integrated system, powerful scheduling and planning software, ensuring that we give capable to promise and we can make sure we indicate when things are going to be running including the number of days late that we may happen to be in this demo software, and whether this is a planned or unplanned work order. We have the number of cycles to go, the hours to go, the setup hours required, the start date and the end date, and of course, the priority that could be applied to these orders. All in all, we have a very cohesive scheduling system that will really help you get the most out of not only your shop floor, but your raw material and third-party purchased items as well. Inventory control may be the single most important factor in improving shop floor efficiency, part and material accuracy, and ultimately bottom line. From tracking inventory and outsourced parts throughout the manufacturing process to reducing the physical inventory time and forecasting necessary for the materials to meet the demands, the manufacturing inventory software modules from Dell MediaWorks helps you to solve every supply chain challenge. Enterprise inventory software is built on facilitating lean manufacturing management principles with functions such as separate inventory master records for each individual manufacturing section, which we call ePlants, both using eKanban, conventional Kanban, or just lot number and traceability, including documents and serialized inventory control. The Advanced Manufacturing Inventory Management System within Del Mio software provides all the functionality to store, track, and fulfill orders based on real-time inventory information from the shop floor, the warehouse, and outsourced and vendor locations. Through the Manufacturing Inventory software tools, we can go ahead and take a look at standard costing, buy and sell pricing, and all of the details required to run a very efficient inventory management system. With these particular areas involved, we can go ahead and make sure we can drive the inventory to the production floor when it's required, ensuring we have optimum quantities of components. A large component of manufacturing a product is its inherent bomb. The bomb is often referred to as a bill of material, but in manufacturing, it really is a bill of manufacture. What's the difference, you might ask? When you take a bill of material, apply it to a manufacturing environment, more and more information is required, like the processes to be applied to each of the items in the bill of material. Once we add the process or multiple processes and the routings through the shop for each of the line items, and possibly some ancillary information that was not included on the original bill of material, like finishes, packaging, and inspections, etc., a bill of material then becomes a bill of manufacture. Accurately addressing the inventory requirements for processing a bomb then becomes extremely important. How the raw material and third-party purchase parts are queued up to ensure everything arrives at the appropriate time in the appropriate manufacturing space is imperative so that the manufacturing process can be exercised as a planned and according to a schedule that meets the customer's required deadline. Are we kidding all of these items and sending them to an assembly area? Are the items queued up to be on a shelf near the machine that will then process them? Or are we using a more sophisticated function like Kanban or Hajunka processes? Of course, we need to access the work orders and functions like shop calendars in order to customize lot numbers in various pieces. We have the ability to jump to various transactions, the locations, the inspection and the setup, even inventory and the bomb tree. So we have all sorts of areas where we can dive into to make sure that the information is set the way we need it. Again, Bill of material being to converted to a bill of manufacture 
is extremely important in the manufacturing process. Inventory handling is expensive. Minimizing handling costs, maximizing warehouse efficiency allows you to gain customers for life. An extension of Dell MeWorks ERP software is the warehouse management system. Offering increased order fulfillment, speed and accuracy, eliminate shipping and receiving and handling errors, and decreasing costs associated with underutilized inventory resources. Allows you to improve inventory visibility and traceability, optimizing both movement of raw materials, whip, and finished goods, and reducing deadhead time in the warehouse. Whether your customers are demanding advanced product storage facilities, or if you're just trying to make better use of the warehousing system that you have now, using the warehouse management system really impacts the way you use things. From basic product picking and inventory movement to tracking to advanced tier one features such as rule-based picking and put away, work order staging, wave planning, palletizing, and more. There are many features available. Here we can see we can set up the warehouse. We have the ability to go and set profiles, assign teams and team members, set up the inventory transaction rules, how things move, where they move. We can look for the expected PO receipts, even setting up wave management sales order picking. Of course, the dock scheduler is key, where it uses a calendar-like look to go ahead and set when things are going to come in so that your team is aware of what's happening and when it's going to happen. Of course, we can do direct task monitoring as well, and we have verification of barcodes and such to make sure that things are moving where they should be and when they should be, making sure that we can find them when we need to. The ERP purchasing system requires integration with the basic accounting and material planning sections of the ERP system, providing integrated material management. Purchasing plays a major role in helping warehouse staff anticipate the arrival of incoming shipments. Once a PO has been issued to a vendor, the user may track to determine its status, schedule the arrival date, and any back order quantities. Tracking POs from the date issued until the arrival date is key to ensure timely delivery and accurate quantities. Integrated with material requirements tools within the system, purchase orders can be automatically generated. Complete PO authorization tools ensure proper authorization levels per acquisition. Version control options allow tracking of all modifications made to a purchase order, including user, date, and time. Vendor RMA features create return material authorizations for products received from a vendor. A complete PO log ensures Historical information of vendor payments, amounts, and PO numbers are available to the users. Tracking vendor performance by monitoring requested and promised delivery dates is of importance as their performance may directly affect your performance. Perhaps one of the most critical aspects of a manufacturing operation is quality management. Whether you're struggling with audits, parts trending out of specification, or a lack of end-to-end -end parts visibility and tracking, the Delmia Works Quality Management Control System can help. The modules offer an extensive suite of tools and capabilities necessary to cost-effectively manage quality issues while streamlining manufacturing and business operations and facilitating collaboration. It's a powerful suite of tools that enable compliance with the most stringent quality standards, including Automotive TS, Medical FDA 21 and CFR Part 11, ISO standards, and reduced cost of quality. Tracking quality and management parts in the same integrated database as your manufacturing, accounting, customer management, and supply chain management systems, the Delmia Works quality management software module is linked directly to all your ERP software and manufacturing-related data, such as RMAs, non-conformance inventory, bombs, and much more with no redundant data entry. Experiencing the power of truly embedded manufacturing quality systems as you eliminate duplicate entries and reduce errors, which in turn simplifies the audit process, improving the decision-making process and creating communications across your supply chain. Naturally, when discussing ERP systems, we mustn't forget the financial aspect of these. Whether it be setting up things in the GL, taking a look at various aspects of you know, the account activity or making sure that we've got the general journal set up, even taking care of AR and AP, PO receiving, making sure the output files from the time and attendance are sent to your third-party payroll system, such as ADP, Ceridian, 
many others. Even taking care of the aspects of credit cards and cash dispersals. We have all of the financial tools required. So there you have it, Del Mealworks ERP side of the software. And uh, what we'll do in the next video is we'll take a look at the MES side, where the manufacturing execution system comes into play, uh, mainly out on the shop floor. Because it's all tied together with software, you'll see how all of these things are interrelated and how the data flows smoothly between the front office and the back office on the manufacturing floor. Mm -hmm.